With Divi AI, the possibilities are endless. It's your new personal web design assistant. It can write content and generate images for you right inside the builder, making it incredibly accessible and helpful. Divi AI understands the context of your website and the pages you're working on, which allows it to generate contextually relevant content. Divi AI allows you to auto-generate content with one click as well as generate images automatically and even refine and modify existing ones. If you're a Divi user, you can sign up for unlimited access to Divi AI by going to elegantthemes.com slash AI. And if you wanna try it out first, you can because every Divi user can access a free trial prior to signing up. Since Divi AI is built into the Divi Builder, make sure you're using the most recent version of Divi. With that out of the way, Let's have some fun. Currently, Divi AI can be accessed everywhere you can add text or images in the Divi Builder. That means Divi AI can be used on any Divi element or Divi module that supports text input and image uploads. You can deploy the Divi AI generator by hovering over an input box and pressing on the Divi AI icon that appears. Some modules will include an auto-generate text with AI button at the top of the content options. This allows you to auto-generate all the text input areas available for a certain module. For example, if you're using a blurb module, you can click auto-generate text with AI to generate content for the title and body area of the module with a single click. Or you can choose to deploy the Divi AI text generator for each one by clicking on the Divi AI icon that shows up in each of the input areas individually. Since this is a blurb module, you also have the ability to generate an image with AI. Under the image and icon option group, hover over the image input box and click the Divi AI options button. Here you're gonna be able to either generate the image automatically or by using the Divi image generator options modal. Also, because Divi Builder structural elements allow you to add background images, you could access the Divi AI image generator under the background image option tab. Divi AI understands your website automatically. This allows it to generate on-brand results in context based on the existing data and content of your website. So it's important to understand what information is needed to allow Divi AI to work its magic. In general, you could expect Divi AI to account for your website title and tagline, as well as page content and the content within modules. So let's say you have a website with the title Divi Interior Design and your tagline is elegant interior design for your home or business, which by the way, this information can be found under settings general. Then let's create a new page and deploy the Divi Builder. To get an idea of what Divi AI already knows, all I have to do is create a text module and simply press auto generate text with AI. As you can see, this will create content specific to the context of your website information on the page. And the content will likely include the title of your website, as we can see right here, and additional content based on the tagline. This is perfect for kickstarting the copy of your homepage. And if I add an image module in here and generate automatically, we should get results of interior design photos that are consistent with my website info. And there we go, I would say that's pretty spot on. Of course, this is just the tip of the iceberg. Divi AI will also analyze the content of your page, allowing you to generate even more on-brand results as you build. The more content you have and the more you use Divi AI on your pages, the better Divi AI will be able to generate accurate results. For example, by the time you reach the end of building your page, you'll be able to generate the content for an entire email opt-in module in a single click. That looks pretty good. <laughs> now that we have a good idea of what Divi AI knows and what it can do, let's go into more detail on how you can use it on your website. Divi Image AI is based off of the Stable Diffusion model, but what makes Divi AI special is that it's specifically built for Divi, giving you access to a powerful assistant for generating images specifically for your website. The options for generating AI images are seamlessly integrated into the Divi Builder, making it easier than ever to get the results you need. You can generate new images with Divi AI using any Divi element or module that supports image content. 
For this example, we are going to use an image module. Once you add the image module to your page, hover over it and simply select the Divi AI icon that appears. From here, we could generate with AI or generate automatically. If you choose generate automatically, Divi AI will generate an image based on the context of your website information. For example, if your website's titled Divi Family Dentistry like mine is, Divi AI will generate images related to dentistry, which is going to give us a picture of a dentist's office. For more targeted results, we can choose generate with AI. This is going to bring up the Divi AI image generator modal, where we can tell Divi AI exactly what kind of image we want. And for starters, you could simply start with a prompt as simple as a portrait of a female hygienist, blue scrubs, portrait lens, and that's it. This should give us some great options to choose from. We could then select and use one of these if we would like, or if we want, we could actually hit generate for more and keep going. In our previous example, we simply typed out an image description and called it a day, which worked out. But as you can see, we skipped a lot of available options. So here is a brief overview of what those are. Our first option allows us to choose from 12 different image styles when generating our AI image. This gives you a wide range of creative style options to create images for any type of design or website. I mean, photo, 3D render, painting, it's all available. The image description is where you can add a text prompt that describes the image you wanna create. The trick here is to be both concise and descriptive. Finding the right prompts may take a few tries to get the results you're looking for, but it can be fun to experiment with different prompts to achieve top tier results. The reference image option allows you to upload an image that Divi AI can use as a style reference. So if you like the overall feel and style of a certain image, you could upload the image as a reference and then use the image description field to make a completely new image based on that reference image. You can adjust how much you want the reference image to impact your description by adjusting the reference image influence dial. You could also adjust the aspect ratio of your image by selecting one of the following options, square, landscape, portrait, or custom size. This is a convenient way to make sure your image will align with common dimensions used for web design and other custom layouts on your page. For example, if you're looking for a full width image to use for a background, you may want to use landscape. But if you're looking for an image blurb module, you may want to use square. Choosing to use a custom size will allow you to designate the exact dimensions you want for an image. However, it's worth noting that if you're using a reference image, the dimensions of that image will be used when generating a new image with Divi AI. You can improve an existing image in Divi using Divi AI. To do this, we're gonna click the Divi AI options button when hovering over an image already loaded inside of the image upload input box. This is gonna bring up a drop down menu with additional options and some quick actions. Generate and replace is equivalent to just starting over. It's going to give us a fresh new prompt for a fresh new image. Reimagine is going to improve the current image that we have, which was also already generated with Divi AI. And then finally, we can change the style to one of the 12 that we saw earlier. But for a quick example, let's check out what Reimagine does to this somewhat basic bedroom. Wow, okay, so this is really cool. It took the very basic floors, the blank walls, the basic white sheets, and basically added some dimension, a throw blanket, extra pillows, some wall art. It just really elevated what we were working with. And just for reference, this was our original image. That looks great, but what if we had something specific we wanted to add or change in this photo? That's where improve with AI comes in. I'm gonna write add blue throughout the room and I'll hit generate. There we go, that's super cool. So I took an image that I had originally generated with Divi AI and I improved it using Divi AI, and now I have something that matches my website perfectly. With Divi Text AI, you could generate any type of text content you need for your website. It's truly a powerful AI writer for your Divi website. Because Divi AI understands your existing content, you could generate content in the context of your website or page. This allows you to keep your copy on brand and write like a professional so you don't have to hire one. Let's jump into the basics of how to get started with Divi Text AI. To generate text for your site with Divi AI, you could use any module that supports text input. For this example, we're gonna be using a blurb module. This module allows you to add text for a title and a body paragraph. You'll notice this large button at the top that says auto-generate text 
with AI. Clicking this will allow Divi AI to automatically fill the title and body text input boxes. Since my current website is an interior design company, Divi AI will suggest content related to my website information. So as you can see right here, it looks pretty good. And since the blurb module also includes an image, it's going to generate an image automatically as well. You can always hover over any individual text input field and click on the Divi AI options button. Once clicked, you can choose to write with AI or write automatically. If you select write automatically, Divi AI will generate text based on the context of your website information and the current field type. For example, with this being a title input field, Divi AI will automatically generate a suggested title, like elevate your space. This is similar to, of course, pressing the button up here, except in this situation, I only wanted it to generate my title field. If you want more control over the content that's generated, you'll want to choose write with AI. This brings up the Divi AI text generator modal, where you can tell Divi AI exactly the kind of content you want. In here, we of course have three main options to choose from. The first option is content type. You can select the type of content you're writing to give Divi AI a better idea of what to generate. This includes everything from paragraph all the way down to social media post. The next section is what are you writing about? This is the main text prompt area where you can describe the content you want Divi AI to generate. And this part is my favorite because if you're anything like me, you don't know. You don't know what you want it to generate. So don't worry, you can let Divi AI make a suggestion. Simply press this AI button right here and Divi AI is going to make a suggestion on what you should have it do. As you can see, it says write about how our interior design services can enhance the functionality and productivity of your office space. So again, context, it's using our website and it knows exactly what our website needs. Speaking of context, the next option is added context. So we could choose to use the entire page or just this section or this module, or depending on our circumstances, we could even say no context at all. We also have this button down here that says guide me. If we press that, a whole bunch of options will appear. This includes tone of voice, which is great for branding. You could tell Divi AI what tone of voice to use when writing your content. Must use keywords allows you to add all keywords that you want to be included in the content that's generated. That's great for SEO, of course, giving you a jumpstart on optimizing content with keywords that help you rank higher in search results. Content length is great because you can define exactly how long you want the generated text to be. You could have it exactly, maximum, at least, and about, and you can do this between words, characters, sentences, paragraphs, and list items. And finally, we have language. This is super cool because you have over 26 languages that Divi AI can proficiently write in. For example, let's say we wanna write content for a blog post. I could add the following options. So for content type, I'll select blog post, for what we're writing about, I'll say, write a blog post on the most popular interior design styles. For added context, I'll say, no context for now. Guide me, I'll go down and I'll say, make it informative, must use keywords, I'll add a couple in here. And for length, we'll do about um, a thousand words. Now I'll just go ahead and press generate text. And just like that, we have a great starting point for a brand new blog post. Divi AI has a ton of handy built-in options for improving your content. To do this, hover over the text input field with the text that you wanna revise and simply press the Divi AI options button. This is gonna bring up a list of options and quick actions to choose from. This will allow you to edit and improve your copy like a pro. With the click of a button, you could fix grammatical mistakes and make content shorter, more engaging, targeted to experts, and so on. For example, I could say, hey, make it more engaging. And that's pretty good. Just a quick click of the button and we're all set and ready to go. Divi AI is a beast of an AI assistant for designing Divi websites. And the more you use Divi AI for your website, the better it gets. If you're not signed up for Divi AI yet, take the opportunity to sign up today and enjoy unlimited prompts you can enter. Go to elegantthemes.com slash AI. Check out our playlist for all of our Divi AI tutorials. If you enjoyed this video, then be sure to give it a like and subscribe for more like it. With that said, thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one.